Good day. Welcome to the Procon YouTube channel. My name is Johan de Plessis. This video will show you how to combine models from files using Procon Frame. I generated a reinforced concrete frame and a steel portal frame beforehand, and now I will show you how to combine the two models. As you can see, here is my reinforced concrete frame. I have four columns in each direction spaced at 6 meters and my top floor is 16 meters from the ground. Next up is my steel portal frame, which has a span of 18 meters and three bays, each 6 meters wide. Notice that I do not have any supports below my columns. This is because I want the steel structure to be supported by the top slab once I've combined the two models. I want to place the steel frame on top of the concrete building. So I'm opening the concrete building and using it as my base model. Keep in mind where both structures are relative to their global coordinate system. This will influence the location where the two models are combined. I know that I want the steel structure to be fixed to the top slab. I also know that the top slab is at an elevation of 16 meters, so I will translate my steel structure by 16 meters in the global y direction. Before I close the function, I have the opportunity to preview the new structure. I will check that all of the nodes are connected that I want connected and that the structure looks satisfactory. Next, I click to add the structure. Once I'm happy with the combined model, I can close the function. Following this procedure, you can combine multiple files together by just adding more files with the combine models function. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. For more tips and tricks, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.